Hey guys, so today's video is going to be a collective clothing haul and I got a whole bunch of stuff for summer. Some of it is kind of not summery that much, but um, we'll just pretend it is. I got all of this stuff over the course of the past month probably, so most of these things, if not all, should still be available for purchase if you guys are interested. So everything that I got online, which is probably like 95%, I will have linked in the description box below. And this is not going to be a try-on haul just because I do have quite a bit of stuff here. It would take a freaking long time. But if you guys are interested, <clears throat> I don't know what just happened there. <clears throat> but if you guys are interested, I am going to be doing a whole bunch of fashion posts on my blog with these items. Um, I'm really excited to get more into fashion blogging because I haven't done a ton with my blog and it's really hard to do fashion posts when you don't have someone to take pictures for you but I talked to my little sister and she said she's gonna help me out so a lot of fashion posts will be coming your way so definitely go check out my blog and follow it to stay updated with that because um, I'll probably do a post with like pretty much everything here so if you guys want to see what it looks like on or see how I would style it definitely go check that out so I'll start with what I'm wearing right now um, these earrings I got really recently from Forever 21 and I just think it's so cute it's a whole bunch of little daisies and then the sweater I'm wearing is from Toby and I actually ordered this like four months ago I ordered this in February and a couple other things here are from Toby too and I contacted them because you're supposed to get it within like two or three weeks I was like uh, like my stuff isn't here I probably contacted them like two months after I was supposed to get it so I asked them if I could get refunded because I didn't get my stuff um, and then they they did like they gave me a refund and then like two more months later I got my package so I wasn't really expecting to get this but that is what it looks like just a baggy pink sweater and it has like a whole bunch of like, little cutouts in it I'll show you a couple of the things that I got from Toby so I ordered these shoes they're just white flats with like the cutout sides I get a pair of white flats every single year because they go with everything, but they also get wrecked pretty fast, so these are my white flats for this year. So I also got this little cranberry colored crop top sweater from Toby, and I think this is going to look super cute with a lot of like high-waisted shorts and skirts, and uh, I have a high-waisted maxi skirt that I think is going to look really cute with this. It is a lightweight sweater, so you could wear this in the summer, like summer evenings I think you could still get away with wearing this. And then the last thing from Toby is this dress, and it's super cute, really flowy, has some lace detailing on it. It looks really short. Um, I opened this package at my mom's house, and I'm like, oh yeah, I got this dress. She's like, that is not a dress. She's like, maybe a long top. But I tried it on, and it actually is longer than it looks, so... You could wear it as a dress, you could wear it as a tunic, but I'm tall too, so if you're short, this would this is like a normal length dress. So now I will show you everything that I got from Windsor or Windsor store. So the first item is this really cute peplum top. I just love the color of the florals. I think it's so like classy looking. Um, and the style of it's really cute too. It has like the higher neck and then the back is open like half open because that's just like the crisscross straps and then of course it has the little peplum part at the bottom so super cute so I also got these camo pants from Windsor I just don't have any camo pants and I think they're kind of a staple you can wear these so many different ways I really wanted to get like a really pale almost like faded camo pant but couldn't find them but I still think that these are pretty nice this top I am obsessed with. Look how bright that is. It's probably really clashing with what I'm wearing right now, but oh, this is the back by the way. So the back has like this crisscross detailing, and then this is the front. It's really sheer, so you could wear this as like a bathing suit cover up or just put a tank top or like bandeau underneath. I'm probably gonna go with a bandeau. Um, and I just love it. It's super loose and flowy, and it has like these lace panels down the sides of the arms. So I also picked up this white bandage style skirt. Um, I love it. The material is thick and stretchy and it's also a little bit longer than most of the bandage skirts I have. So I really like this. I think this will look really cute with that floral peplum top I got. So this is the maxi skirt I was saying would look cute with the crop top I got. Um, it's just plain black. It has a slit that comes like halfway up your leg. 
um, near like the front and then it's also high-waisted so I can wear it like over my belly button and it's still really long which I like and it also came with this belt so it's like a brownie black belt so that is that one this dress is unfortunately too small for me um, not too small but too short just because I am 5'10 I'll show you maybe I can stand up and show you But I'm really sad it doesn't fit me because it's really cute. Um, it just has this lacy sweetheart style, almost like a bustier style top. And the cutout is so cute at the back because it kind of looks like a bow. And then you have like this little space here. And then the bottom part is really pretty. I love the colors in it. And it also has like um, the like short skirt slip underneath. So it's like not see-through up until here, but then the bottom part is kind of sheer. I was going to give this to my little sister because I think it would be like perfect length on her, but she says she doesn't wear dresses, so it's probably going to go to one of my friends. And the last thing I got from Windsor are these shoes. How cute are these? They're really high though. They're probably like five inches maybe. Um, so when I wear these, I'm about six foot three, which makes me a ginormous human being, but they're so cute. Probably won't wear them a ton just because I do become a giant, but I'll wear them occasionally. They will look good with a ton of different outfits. So yeah, those are those. Picked up one thing from Savile Skirt. I've never ordered anything from them before because they're a little bit pricey, but they have so many cute things and I just had to order these pants. I think they're called Palazzo Pants. Um, they're just like the really wide leg. And it almost looks like a maxi skirt when you wear it because the legs are so loose and flowy. Um, it also comes in a bright purple color, which was really cute as well. And they are high-waisted and just extremely cute. So the last online store that I picked some stuff up from is Hot Miami Styles. And I originally thought that Hot Miami Styles only sold like bandage dresses, but they actually sell like regular clothes too, which I had no idea um, until I saw someone else's haul. So I got a bunch of stuff from there, and I love everything that I got. So the first thing I got, I actually wore the other day uh, downtown for my friend's birthday. And if you guys want to see how this fits and everything, I do have a picture on Instagram. So it's just like this plain long sleeve dress. And the only thing about this is it is pretty short, so the entire time I was like pulling it down. But besides that, it's so cute. It's like... A really tight material but it's kind of like thicker so it just like fits really well and I love it kind of obsessed with the matching sets that are kind of in style right now so I got this one and it comes with this black lacy crop top and then the matching skirt I don't like how the skirt fits as much as the top does so I've actually been wearing the crop top with different bottoms but the set as a whole is really cute together. It's just like the bottom part isn't really tighter on my legs. Um, but that is what that set looks like. I didn't really think I was going to get back into the tie-dye trend. But I got this shirt because I saw it on there and I thought it was really cute. Um, it's kind of cropped, which I didn't notice. Long sleeves and the front part has like this v-neck. And I just love the colors of the tie-dye. I think it would look really cute with like white bottoms or something. And then the last thing I got from there are these super adorable shorts. They're kind of a silky material and then it has the lace trim at the bottom. Love the colors. I just think they are adorable. And that is all I got from Hot Miami Styles. And then I have two more items that I got really recently that I just got from my local mall. But I will share them anyways. So this top... I got from, I think it was either Sears or The Bay, it's from the Vera Moda brand, and it was on sale, so I bought it for about $15. I just like how it's kind of like the knitted material. And then the last thing I got is just a pair of white Converse, because I didn't have any, and I think these go with pretty much everything. So definitely we'll get a ton of use out of these, and I picked these up from Softmock, but I know so many places sell them, you can get them online if you want. Honestly, I paid like 70 bucks for these and I know you can get these cheaper, so that is that. So that concludes my fashion haul. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. Don't forget to check out my vlog for upcoming fashion posts and I will see you guys all in my next video.